The Last Starship from Earth is a 1968 science fiction novel by John Boyd, and is his best-known novel. Plot summary The novel is set in a dystopian society in the very near future. Although it is not obvious at first, this is also an alternate history story. The central character is Haldane Ivey, a mathematician, in a caste-based society. He forms a forbidden relationship with Helix, a poet. He also becomes interested in investigating Fairweather, a famous mathematician who lived shortly before his time, and his son Fairweather too, whom he discovers led a rebellion, which was defeated. Eventually he is given a show trial and deported to another planet, where he meets Fairweather too. In this world, Jesus Christ became a revolutionary agitator and was never subjected to crucifixion. He assembled an army to overthrow the Roman Empire, and established a theocracy that has lasted until the 20th century. He was killed by a crossbow while entering Rome, so the crossbow becomes a religious symbol similar to the cross in our timeline. Trilogy. The book is supposedly the first in a trilogy. The other books appear to be The Pollinators of Eden, and The Rakels of Heaven. Critical response Robert A. Heinlein said, "...it belongs on the same shelf with 1984 and Brave New World." And the Los Angeles Times noted, in the literate tradition of Huxley, Orwell, and Bradbury, it is a work of extraordinary impact." Joanna Russ, in her review of the book in 1969, was highly critical, writing, I forgive Mr. Boyd the anguish his novel caused me and hope he will eventually forgive me the anguish this review may cause him, but for Berkeley there is no forgiveness. Only reform. Don't do it again. Spider Robinson, however, praised the novel as Delightful, with a rigorously consistent internal logic that doesn't really become apparent until the very last chapter. 